take a deep breath in. And as you breathe in, breathe in a feeling of serenity, a stable calmness, that as you breathe it in, it just helps everything to relax. And as you breathe out, just feel that the opposite of serenity is leaving your body. Any tension, any stress, any worries, any emotions that have been hanging around way too long. Feel how good it feels to breathe in a wonderful feeling of relaxation and as you exhale to allow that stress and tension to melt away and feel it leave your body in that outward breath. As you breathe in and breathe out, I want you to imagine that you have a magical ability that some people call astral projection. An ability to go anywhere in the world just by using your mind. So breathe in and breathe out making yourself comfortable, feeling a desire to yawn, and imagining the last time you had a long, enjoyable yawn, giving permission for your body to let go. And I want you to hold an image in your mind, an image of a picturesque, English town with houses made of traditional stone with a small shallow river running through that town and some people would call it the most beautiful town in England. So I want you to hold that image in your mind of that beautiful town with a shallow river, with ducks perhaps swimming on the surface. And as you hold that image in your mind, I want you to imagine there is someone in that town that looks like you. see them walking perhaps by the river and I wonder what would happen if you used this power of astral projection to imagine what it would be like to step into their shoes to be them just for a few moments to imagine walking by that river and as you do so Notice the pace that you're walking. Notice the large willow trees. The slow, shallow river. The tiny bridges. I want you to feel a wave of relaxation washing over you. There's a story of a woman that also went to this town. And in the quaint village of Borton on the Water, where the river Windrush whispers serenity, there meandered a soul named Ellie. Her heart a mirror 
to the river's calm, sought solace along the water's gentle embrace. With each step, the river's slow and shallow flow reminded her to breathe, to let the currents of peace wash over her. That the river's tranquility was a balm, teaching Ellie that life's rhythm needn't be hurried. Ellie approached the arched bridges, each a testament to the village's resilience. As she crossed, she saw them as symbols of her own triumphs, archways to new chapters, affirming that no challenge was too great, no distance too far. As she walked by the river, she saw an old building with a poem etched into the surface of the rocks. And just reading it to herself in her own mind, she digested the words. In Borton on the water where dreams alight, by windrush banks under soft sun's delight, stone bridges arch across the gentle flow in the Cotswolds' heart where time moves slow. Quaint cottages kiss the tranquil stream as willows weep and in the daylight gleam. Ducks meander in playful quacking bands Nature's chorus across verdant lands. Every footstep on cobblestone path echoes tales of old and nature's bath. A village cradled by emerald embrace welcomes each soul with a serene grace. Borton on the water with charm so bright Whispers peace and sets hearts alight In this hamlet find life's sweetest treasure Moments of joy too vast to measure Ellie allowed the words to be planted like seeds in her deep subconscious mind. Some would grow, some may not. As she continued to walk by the riverbank, ducks glided by, their playful chase a dance of distraction. Yet Ellie found joy in their presence, learning that distractions need not perturb the spirit, but could delight and enrich her journey. As the dusk painted the sky with hues of closure, Ellie's walk by the river culminated in a heart full of tranquility. Her path, like the river's gentle flow, taught her that calm and relaxation could coexist with life's inevitable distractions and challenges. Ellie pondered on what she had learned from that walk. And it was just simple yet profound. Life, like the river, flows best when met with grace, courage and a smile for the ducks that paddle alongside us. As you imagine being there in the same town as Ellie. And perhaps for a moment or two you even managed you were 
Ellie yourself. What if you were to imagine time flowing like a gentle river, encouraging you to move with patience and grace, that each breath you took was a wave of calmness washing over you, slowing your pace to that of nature's rhythm. So feel a wonderful sense of tranquility rising up inside you, urging you to embrace each moment with ease and allow the space between thoughts to expand, creating room for patience to grow and flourish. With every heartbeat, feel yourself becoming more patient, more rooted in the present moment. And imagine yourself back in your reality, moving through your day with a serene smile unhurried and completely at peace. You could think of patience as a soft cloak draped over your shoulders, comforting and warm, slowing your steps to a peaceful tread. As you acknowledge that there is plenty of time for everything, feeling any urgency dissolve into calm. Because maybe the world around you is also willing to move at a relaxed pace in harmony with your newfound patience. Hold the thought of a clock in your mind's eye with hands moving in slow motion synchronizing your heartbeat with the gentle tick of patience. And maybe that patience is a seed within you and you can water it with each calm breath, watching it sprout and take root. As you stare into the river, momentarily see it stop flowing as you believe in the power of stillness finding clarity and tranquility in moments of quiet, peace and stillness. Allow the river to flow again and acknowledge the strength, pound in patience, feeling it build within you. Like the gradual rise of the sun. Say the words slow and steady just to yourself, feeling its truth resonate with every fiber of your being. And let the gentle rhythm of nature be your guide, teaching you the art of not rushing but savoring. Breathe in patience with the cool morning air and exhale any haste like the evening's last light. Encourage your thoughts to drift lazily like clouds across a clear blue sky, embodying the essence of calm. There is a time to rush and hurry, but there is also a time to take things slow. So embrace the beauty of taking your time finding joy and appreciation in the unhurried journey, feeling a sense of harmony with the universe as you align with the tempo of patience. And what if you were to conclude each day with gratitude for each and every moment you experience genuine patience, knowing it brings you closer to a life of peace. Just as Ellie had seeds planted in her subconscious, allow these seeds to be planted in your subconscious. Not all will grow, but not all needs to. Allow the suggestions that align with you 
to take root. That every deep, slow breath waters those seeds, giving you the right, but not the obligation, for moments of peace and tranquility and serenity. As you stare into the Whip River, feeling that tranquility, it's time to leave this body that you've been borrowing for a few moments. Feel yourself hovering out, allowing that person to carry on walking by the river as you feel like you're returning back to your body, accepting that this journey by a tranquil river in a quaint village in the Cotswolds is just a thought within a thought, an idea within an idea, a dream within a dream. As you return to your reality, taking some of that serenity, peace and tranquility with you. As you take a deep breath in through your nose and out through your nose. Wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes. Connect it there here and now in the present moment. As very soon I count from one to ten to awaken you. You will awaken feeling calm relaxed as if time is now on your side feeling that with this time you can steer your life exactly where you want to starting to count one two three waking up four five six more alert seven eight open your eyes open your eyes nine ten wide awake wide awake wide awake 